Hi, welcome to my video where I'll be showing you how to make a miniature stone wall. Now this wall is going to be sitting on my porch roof, so it's very important that it's light. So I've got these volcanic pumice stone rocks. Now in England it's not very volcanic, so we've got um, these from a garden retailer. They're usually used in the bottom of these clay ovens here because they retain heat. They're also really light because they've got gas vesicles, little gas bubbles inside when they formed. Now if you live in a place that has volcanoes, you can usually find these on the beach because they are light and they float. First thing we need to do is empty the bag and sort out the stones. Much like we do making a big stone wall, we need to find the ones that look good that we're going to use for the tops and the sides of the wall. Everything else we're going to put at the bottom or the back of the wall. Okay, now we've sorted our pumice stones in three separate piles. We've got our big pile, we've got a knobbly middle pile, and then we've got our flat edge stones which we're going to be using for the tops and the facing. Next thing we need to do is lay the stones out, which is why I've got Let's see, this big red ring here, this is where our wall's going to be. We're going to lay them out and see how they fit. Okay, so I've laid out some of these foundation stones. Um, I've chipped some bits off. It's very difficult to build up the rest of the wall I've found, um, not like a real wall, because these things are so light they keep falling off. So what I'm going to do is mix some mortar now and we're going to stick these ones together so we've got a firm foundation for the rest of the wall. Okay, so we're going to lay out the foundations. We've got a little red line to mark where the wall's going to go. What I do is put down a little bit of mortar along the red line as our little base to hold things in place. Get quite wet mortar because these are very porous stones. Stick some on the side, stick some on the bottom, Oops, plopped off. Stick some on the bottom and scoop them in next to each other. Uh, this is the back of the wall so it doesn't matter if it's a bit of a mess. Front face will look a bit neater. There we go, that's our first course laid. So by the magic of video, our stone wall is done. It took about six to eight hours. The only problem I had with these pumice stones are really light, so it's not like making a proper stone wall where they're just going to sit where you lay them. I'm pretty pleased with the result. It's going to look good when we've got soil on here. It's going to make these stones stand out. Obviously, we're not going to see the inside or this grey concrete. We're just going to see our nice rustic stone wall outside. So that's how you make a miniature stone wall.